welcome to the project demonstration of Coleman safety uh, system uh, using uh, IoT technology for ESP8266 ESP and PIC microcontroller. So in this we are going to monitor the three major parameters with the two sensors. One is DSG11 sensor from this we are going to get the humidity and temperature and another is the gas sensor. Whenever the abnormality was detected from these two sensors so the abnormal message will be sent and displayed on the LCD screen and also sent to the mobile phone application through IoT that is through this ESP8266 Wi-Fi module along with it will generate the audible alert through this buzzer. So the whole system driven by this PIC 16F73 microcontroller which will take the input from the uh, DSG11 which was interfaced at the C0 pin and A0 pin for this gas sensor and the continuous state is displayed on the LCD screen and that was connected at the pin number B22, pin number B7 and Wi-Fi module interfaced at the pin number B0, B1 and C4 for this buzzer to get the audible alerts directly and here we are providing the power supply from this adapter in real time we can place a power bank directly by providing this USB to the power bank USB so before demonstration first of all we need to enable the hotspot in your phone so go to hotspot settings and change the hotspot name to project 6041 without any space without any capital letter and password should be 12345689 and AP band should be 2.4 gigahertz after enabling the hotspots we need to install the two applications one is network analyzer application and another is a juice so this one we will provide you that application and the network analyzer application also we will provide you that so install these two applications then on the power supply to this kit so you can see one device will be connected in your phone so take a confirmation like yeah one device was connected then uh, go to network analyzer application So then we need to get the IP address of our kit. So then do LAN scan options and do LAN scan and copy this IP address. One is your mobile phone, another is our ESP8266 Wi Fi module. Next, go to Juice SSH application. So manage connections. Let me show you from starting onwards. Delete. Right. Add. So first of all, type telnet and address which we got from that application. And the next port number 8080. Right. After these settings are full done, click on this. So this is the message we are going to continuously receive. And the same will be displayed on the LCD screen. Okay. Right. Now let us provide the input for this sensors. So if we make a gas input so you can just press that don't go like this just only press you can hear the sound of LPG's leakage so you can see the same visual indication of the red LED and a buzzer indication and the same message indication on this phone application also so just I am blow the hot air we can increase the humidity right when you blow the hot air from your mouth not the like cool air hot air as you can see the humidity got increased same thing we can use the temperature same message will be received in your mobile phone 